Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. I am happy to be bringing you guys my Fallout 4 Let's Play. It's about four months late-ish. A little bit less than that, like three and a half months late. Uh, but we are going to do this, and we're going to have some fun. Um, I'm just going to play this for fun. I don't know if I'll 100%. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. But I'm just going to play, have some fun, enjoy the time. Um, hopefully the audio is all good to go. This is my main character. 4 days, 10 hours, 58 minutes, so I have a lot of experience in this game. It's been a while though, it's been a... Has it been two months since I've actually played Fallout? Um, but I am back and I'm ready to go. Let's hop into this new game, start it up, let's go. Let's roll. This cutscene, I love this opening cutscene. Um, it's just crazy how good of a job they did with this opening cutscene. And then how sad the last cutscene was. Just how bad it was. It is so disappointing how that how this game ends. I wish it ended a lot differently with a better cutscene. For some reason my brand new headphones are beeping. What is going on? Alright, I'm gonna shut up. I can't talk during this cutscene. War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the veterans hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. All right. So I could sit here for roughly like two hours and customize my character and have it look almost exactly the same as they do right now because I always feel like when I jack around with their facial features and different stuff like that, I always make them look worse. Like I, I don't know. I just don't have a gift for. Hey, doing um guy. I, I just don't have a a gift for creating characters in games 
That's why I'm happy the preset one looks good to me. I like I like how she looks because I'm playing as a girl. I'm not even gonna mess with customizing the guy. You can cycle through these faces, but it's really hard to tell if you like the face until you mess with all the hair color and hairs and eyes and all that. So I'm not even gonna mess with it. I'm not gonna put you guys through that torture of me doing that. Uh, so let's go ahead and just do the simple stuff I want to change. My last character I believe had. Was it Auburn hair? I think she had. I think I had her have Auburn. I'm gonna go with golden blonde this time. And oops, let me go eyes. I'm gonna go pale blue. Hopefully, I don't sneeze here. Type of eyes. I think Sean has my eyes. Prominent. I don't even see the difference between. Okay, I don't even see the difference. What the heck is the difference between Prominent 3 and 4? Still got it. Okay, I'm sticking with Prominent 2. I don't even know. Okay, I think everything facial feature-wise, I don't want to change the skin color. Because the others look stupid. Rosie looks decent. But... Sunkissed and tan don't even they don't even look tan. It looks weird. It looks like a chromey tan and I don't like it. I don't like burned or bronze. It doesn't even look like bronze looks alright. Burn burn looks decent too. But I'm gonna stick with the pale because the pale isn't really that pale. It's not like pasty white. Okay, but makeup time. I don't even see the difference between the blushes. We're gonna go with blush too. And if I just put like all of these on, what does your lips look like? If I take this off. Oh, okay. I do see the difference. Okay, so you want the lipstick with the lip gloss. Okay, that's how I like it. I'm not going to mess with the eyeliner because that doesn't even make any sense for post. I don't want the lower shadow. I don't want the upper eye shadow. Right? Do I want some eye shadow? See, this is what I'm talking about. You can do this forever. You can sit here and mess with this for literally forever. Yeah, I'm just going to leave her... I didn't apply my crap. Or my blush. Blush 2. And I don't want those. Okay, Sweetie, except... You look as beautiful as the day we met. Alright, thank you for that cheesy crap in the background, Nate. Alright, body. You, I, I just prefer the bodies in this game, even though you don't even see it that often, that's thin, closer to the muscular, I guess. About right there. Let's go there. Okay, we're done. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. That's it. There's the character. We're not messing with him because he dies. If you don't know that he dies, and I just spoiled the whole... Spoiled this for you, then I'm sorry, but... He's not important. I don't need to change his look. I also want to know, is that actually how hot coffee is? 173... That seems really hot. 173.5. Also, I like the car. I like the car. Since I've already played through this, I'm going to look at some other stuff that I never looked in, looked at. It's pretty, pretty plain and simple backyard. Not bad. There's a dog bowl here, but no dog in this house. Well, what else do we got? We got, like, a... I know we were nervous at first, but I'm glad we got Codsworth. What is activating the American flag do? Good old U.S. of A. Okay, that's it. Okay. Also here, you guys didn't see it, but he pulls this newspaper out of, like, thin air. Like, I want to know where he had that. Oh, there's the Vault Tech guy. 
Here he comes to our door. There's a hollow tape player here. Uh, any other cool stuff in this room? There's some bourbon. Oh, and there he is. I guess I'll get the door. Good morning. vault calling. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. I'm here now. So you are. <laughs> so you are. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being, um, <laughs> a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. But I have a family. You can fit us all, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. Sure, let's do it. Splendid! Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. Okay, so, registration for... I was going to do Queen Reject, but then... War Miss Queen, which doesn't sound right. So I'm going to go with the name Alexis. Megan is usually my go-to, just because... I don't know why. Uh, but I'm going to go with Alexis, because I can't go with the same name. Then I'll get the characters confused, and all sorts of chaos ensues. But we're going 7 Intelligence... I think 4 Agility, 4 Endurance, 5 Charisma, 3 Strength, 3 Perception, I want to go 4 Perception, that's Accuracy, hmm, the total health and the action points drained from Sprinting, hmm. I drop, drop that to three. Won't be able to sprint as much. Hmm. I'm gonna go with... I'm gonna go with this. Five agility, seven intelligence, five charisma, four endurance, three perception, and three strength. Let's go with that. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Miss Alexis, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? Yeah, see, so Cosworth calls me Alexis, like he actually knows my name. Which is cool. Which is cool that they actually had whoever voices Cosworth just read a bunch of names, so he's able to say a bunch of names, which is really cool. My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? That's my boy, on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, 
Sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Let's go check on Codsworth. Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes. Blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get confirmation. Wait, we seem to what? have lost contact with what our affiliate say? stations. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh, my God. We need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. How did he grab Sean so fast? He's out! Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered. Evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Come on, Nate, move it. Hold on, little guy. Hold on. Save the bag. Who cares? Just help me pack it up. Who cares about the stupid luggage? This makes this. I can't lose things. It'll be all I have left. This makes no sense. The bag is closed and. Uh, why can't she just help him pick the bag up? Is it really that big of a deal? It takes like. I am not on the list. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop sure. me. Oh, 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 okay, okay. I'm reporting this. If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. You two, follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. All right, up to the step on the platform in the center. If only Nate wasn't so slow. Move it, Nate. Give me the baby. Almost there. Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're going to be okay. I love you. Oh my god! No, no! Take it down now! Hold on! Can't this thing move faster? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. See, because that because that lady wouldn't help her husband pick up his bag. Now they're now they're dead. They just got incinerated. We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later. No, no, we don't. Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs okay. and through the door this there. For you. All just new this residents, way, please. Please this proceed way. in an orderly fashion. Male. Welcome this way, please. Home. Female. Just this way. This one's good. Step Male. over to the table and take a seat. Okay. Just step Female. over to the Those table. Good. Welcome. Pick up a suit right over there. Here you are. Female. Head down the Looks hall fine. there. Right You'll need there, your please. suits before we can take you further. What the heck? <laughs> what is going on? What is that? What the Thanks. heck was that? What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. Homie just took He's like... The hallway right there. This is our new home. Oh, Before they start talking... Love it here. This Take is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's okay, Bob. Our home. Everything we had. Ma'am? My mother and father down in this eight. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a 
good fit, don't Just you think? checking everyone the off the list. The vault safe is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Okay, like I was gonna say, Homie took like three vault suits. Mommy's right here. See, honey, could you help me? Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. All right, let's hop in. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three. This is the one. Here. Open it. <laughs> is it over? Are we okay? Almost. Everything's gonna be fine. I don't get why he wouldn't get... They look like... Science. I would give... Maybe they're just trying to help you so you can give them the baby you can get out of the pod. Also, what did he think the outcome was going to be if he did... If he, if he held on to the baby? His best bet was to give it to him. I'll get Sean back. I promise. Alrighty, guys. That's going to do it for episode one. I think this is a perfect kind of cutoff point between episodes. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, if there are any audio issues, you can be sure I'll get them fixed. Um, I'll try to fix them in the next episode, obviously. And if not... Obviously, I will fix them. I'll, I'll just keep working on them until they're perfect. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.